Jamie. I'm the PTNS coordinator here at Alliance Urology, where I manage the PTNS program uh, for our overactive bladder patients. Uh, this is a treatment that we use, that we prescribe for patients that have overactive bladder and they have tried maybe a few medications and either the medications didn't work for them or they had some type of side effect. So this is the next step in line um, as it's the least invasive of the third line therapies. The most important part of my role is educating the patients, encouraging them to keep engaged with the therapy, and celebrating their successes along the way, which gives us all hope. I start by explaining how PTNS works because everyone wonders how the ankle, the tibial nerve, and the brain work together in OAB. I make sure that they get a copy of our PTNS brochure so they can review this at home with their family. If they want, I share a video link on how PTNS works. Then I set their expectations by explaining what I typically see with other patients. In terms of results, one third see tremendous improvement, like 50 to 75% or more. One third see improvement, and the last third, it doesn't work very much. Studies show that up to 80% of patients improve in this therapy. While may, many patients will see significant improvements by about week six. In a study of 150 patients, about 20% of patients didn't see improvement until after week eight. Some patients didn't respond until week 12. I give them our bladder log so they can chart their voiding and use this to benchmark their improvement. I schedule all 12 appointments up front, taking into account their schedules and providing flexibility. As we're talking about their schedule, I'm learning about them, their family, what keeps them busy, and building our personal rapport. Their relationship with me helps keep them going through the therapy. Before their first appointment, I phone them as a reminder and to give them hope that they're entering a therapy that can make their lives better. Each time that they come in for a therapy, we visit together. We review my PTNS weekly summaries. We also go over their bladder log and I show them the improvement from the baseline. When they're on maintenance therapy, I ask them to complete the diary the week before treatment. We celebrate these improvements together and that gives them encouragement to stick with it. Because they see me as their advocate, I help them navigate other urology needs. They might ask me, hey, can you schedule me with the provider because I'm having pain? I'm happy to take on these additional responsibilities to help make it easier for my patients to get care. As we all know, patients can come in with a mixture of symptoms, with a little stress, urge, and mix incontinence. When I see someone who might benefit from additional therapy, I'll coordinate with other team members, such as the physical therapy team, to provide a multidisciplinary care. I might explain it to the patient as, do you want to try a few sessions with PT to see if this helps? When patients get better, it really makes my day.